Hi, I'm Louis from LCD Heating and Gas Services. This is just a short video on the Hive controller and some of its functions. So the controller will normally be like this. To wake it up, you just turn the dial and you'll see the target temperature and the actual temperature. The target temperature is what you want the room to heat to. And the actual temperature is what it actually is near the controller. Doesn't mean that all oh, the other rooms are that temperature, but where the controller is, that's the temperature. So you can use it on manual mode. Again, you wake it up like that, and then you would just turn the dial to your desired temperature. So I'm just going to choose 21 degrees just to show you. So it's 21 degrees as a target, and the actual is 18.2. So now this will bring the boiler on until this area heats up to your target temperature. Likewise, if it's too too hot and you're wanting it off, wake it up again. And just turn it down. So turn it down nice and low. I think down to 11, 12 means that it won't come on unnecessarily. If you turn it to 16 or 17, it'll turn it off, but all it takes is for the house to cool a couple of degrees and it'll switch itself back on. Also what the, this feature's got is get a boost mode. So you can boost it for 30 minutes, one hour, two, three, four, five, six, and off. So to confirm any of these, you would just press the green tick and it would now come on and stay on until it reaches your target temperature for the next hour. Okay, so to cancel that mode, you just flick through until off and confirm. Okay, so that's using it manually. Obviously, it gives you different options. You can go in here, you've got heat, which is your central heating times, holiday mode, and settings. Okay, so won't complicate it too much, but you press the dial here, you've got your schedule, which is basically your on off times and temperatures, manual, which you would just use it as a room thermostat, and off, which is off. Your whole water will still work if you've got a combi, but it'll be the central heat that'll be off. So for talk's sake, you just confirm with a click and you can view and edit your, your, exist, uh, your actual set temperatures you've got in it just now. Go through the weeks. It talks you through it, you know, so it's on at half six, off at half eight, 20 degrees it's heating up to, then it's staying off until half four, then it's staying on until 10 o'clock at night. So you just confirm in here and you can then set it, okay? so. Just talks you through it, it's pretty simple to use and as I say, worst case scenario, you can use it manually if you're a bit confused with the times or whatever and you can override it as well. So if you're ever just needing a boost for an hour, that's what you do. So I hope that was useful. Thank you.